Eden Prime. This is where it all began. Where the Prothean Beacon gave you the vision that warned us about the Reapers. And where you went up against Saren and the Geth for the first time, no? Yes. And now, with Cerberus here, Eden Prime's colonists are under attack again. Seems like more than just three years ago. How bad? A lot of dead civilians. Lost one of my men, Jenkins, to a Geth drone. Reports said Saren had bombs set up to wipe out the whole colony. Not on my watch. Damn straight, loco. Cerberus hit Eden Prime hard. Whatever they found here was worth a major offensive. There are survivors elsewhere on the colony, but... They killed everyone near the dig site. They deserve better. I know. The Alliance did what it could to evacuate colonists, but... Cerberus came in so quickly. If we find survivors, we'll do what we can. What about this artifact? Is it part of the Prothean device we found on Mars? The Alliance didn't get any specifics about what Cerberus has uncovered. But whatever it is, it's better off with us than with Cerberus. I'm bringing you in as close to the dig site as I can. No way we'll avoid detection, but you should have a few minutes. Appreciate it. All part of the service, Commander. All right, everyone. Get ready to move. With luck, we can get to the dig site before Cerberus knows we're here. No sign of survivors. Come on, we need to find the dig site. This was a beautiful colony once. They came back after the Geth attack. They'll come back from this. I grew up on ships. Lose one, you can always move on to another. data could help the colonists still alive on other parts of Eden Prime. How? I can get this intel to Eden Prime's resistance. Maybe it will help them fight back against Cerberus. 
Look at that. Bits of Prothean tech sticking out of the ground like an old bone. Hey, Liara, you ever find dinosaurs while you're digging around? No. Dinosaurs and other fossils would be paleontology. I'm an archaeologist. I study artifacts left by sapien species. The two fields are completely different, and... Oh, you weren't joking. Hey, how do you like dinosaurs? There. That's the elevator that leads down into the dig site. Goddess, that doesn't seem possible. It's not a Prothean artifact, it's... A Prothean. You mean a collector? Those things the Reapers turn the Protheans into? No. An original, unmodified Prothean, who's still alive. You're right. That doesn't sound possible. You saw Prothean stasis chambers in the archives on Ilos. The only reason those failed was a lack of power. Cerberus found this in an underground bunker. It still has power. He's been in stasis for the past 50,000 years, waiting for us. Think of what we could learn. What can you tell me about the Protheans? The people, not the technology. Given your experience with the Prothean Cypher, you probably know as much about them as I do. The Prothean Empire spanned the known galaxy. They uplifted countless other species to help them join the galactic community. Uplifted, huh? Like when the Solarians helped the Krogan to evolve a little... faster. Yes. Judging by the dig sites like the Prothean Archive on Mars or here on Eden Prime, the Protheans wanted other species to learn. It's clear that they prize knowledge, growth, and cooperation with the rest of the galaxy. The way you describe them, they sound a lot like the Asari. I'm certain I'm coloring their culture with my own perceptions. Whatever the Protheans were, finding one alive represents an incredible opportunity. This could be what we need to finish the Prothean device. I hope so. If this single Prothean was sent into stasis, he could be the foremost scientist of his time, or perhaps the wisest counselor. Ah, <sighs> Cerberus damaged the life pod when they excavated it. The life signs are unstable. Then let's get him out of there. No, breaking open the pod would kill him. We have to find the command signal that ends the stasis mode. We also need to figure out how to physically open the pod without doing more damage. Cerberus took over the labs nearby to research what they found at the dig site. That's likely our best bet. Heads up! Get moving before more of them come back.
intel to help the colonists. The more we find, the better chance they'll have. Footage of the Protheans. Cerberus is studying it to figure out how to physically open the pod. How many have we lost? Reaper forces have destroyed approximately 300,000 life pods. duplicate that to open the life pod. You understood that? You didn't? No. All I saw was static. Cerberus was trying to make sense of it without success. The Prothean cipher you received on Pharos, it lets you see the images as a Prothean would, and understand their language. Whatever it does, I saw the video. And how they sealed the life pods. 
Perfect. Then we just need the signal they use to activate stasis mode. They were gunned down while having drinks and watching the game. Son of a bitch, this was somebody's home.
the Protheans. Cerberus. Systems. Broadcast the stasis readiness signal to all life pods. And the, the refugees, refugees who have yet to reach the bunker. Their sacrifice will be honored in the coming empire. Got the signal the Protheans used to activate stasis mode. Excellent. Then we have everything we need to open the pod. 